has some wonderful news today that I'm very excited about. New at 11, a revolutionary treatment this woman credits for giving her a second chance at life. First News got a look at how East Liverpool City Hospital is using fish skin to heal open wounds or burns. Now, I do want to warn you, there will be some graphic images shown in just a moment. Now, this type of treatment has really been in the news a lot lately. A similar method just treated bears that were burned in California's wildfires. But right here in the Valley, 27 investigates how the treatment called Kerasis is helping people escape pain. 27 First News anchor Stan Boney has the details. We're going to go in the same room as always. Diane Simmons is making her second weekly trip to the wound care center at East Liverpool Hospital. I have two ulcers that I've been to wound clinics for over three years and I haven't made much progress at all. I am so excited about this. I, I just can't wait to see where I go from the first application now to the second. The ulcers on her legs cause a lot of pain. Nurses remove the bandages. That looks really, really good. Then clean the wound and measure it to see how Kerasis is helping it to heal. The depth is half of what it was last week. That's good news for Simmons. What's happened already in a week is more than I've had in the last three years. East Liverpool City Hospital is the only medical center with the Kerasis fish skin treatment in our area. Its deal with the company locks out hospitals in Youngstown and Pittsburgh. Surgeons here have welcomed the new treatment for a frequent problem. In this area, we see a lot from people that have chronic problems like diabetes, like smoking, uh, and they just don't have a good normal healing process. The Kerasis bandage contains a lot of omega-3 fatty acids. Doctors tell us it's porous. That allows a patient's skin cells to grow through and over it. This is like almost 70 percent the same as human skin and because of that it works but because it's not completely human skin the body will absorb it over time and replace it with your own skin. Unlike skin grafts from elsewhere in a patient, using the fish skin does not require surgery or putting someone to sleep. We'll spray with a little bit of topical anesthetic, basically like a cooling spray to, to just anesthetize the skin a little bit. But the fish skin comes to East Liverpool from thousands of miles away. A team from the hospital just traveled to the western fjords of Iceland to see how this miracle cure is made. Starting with North Atlantic cod caught in the icy waters, the skin is removed as the fish is processed for food. Then the skin is treated in a lab and used to help patients like Diane Simmons. I hope that this allows me to be able to wear uh, socks and hose again and to be able to live a normal life. Stan Boney, WKBN 27 First News. The Kerasis treatment is FDA approved and covered by most insurance companies and Medicare. Now doctors tell us it can be used on almost any large wound that is free of cancer cells. If you want to learn more about this, look for a link inside the story on the WKBN mobile app and website.